Tony. My name is Siddhi Singh. My name is Pranit Ramasi. My name is Tanish Kalukya. My name is Bani Sinjalia. And I am Kaliyuga. <laughs> I was a devotee. I am Sol. I am mine. mine. He is one of my friends and he also helped us in this act. So this is Kajal. So she also took summer camp the first time and she engaged all these children. Otherwise now what do you think all the children will be doing? The whole day with the mobile. But see now, uh, don't you think this is this is all released to Srila Prabhupada? Because Srila Prabhupada has made all these arrangements. Okay, so uh, chant one Hare Krishna Mahamantra for this full group. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare. Thank you. Now next, uh, you can take your seats, all of you uh, take your seats. Now you wanted to recap yesterday what happened, right? So you can come. So, first introduction to Bhagavad Gita. Jigyasa. Desire to inquire. To know. First action of human being is to inquire. If you have intelligence, then only you will be able to inquire. So, animals also have intelligence, but not as like human. So, as uh, as we human being, we should first inquire that uh, what Jigyasa. Desire to inquire. To know. First action of human being is to inquire. If you have intelligence, then only you will be able to inquire. So, animals also have intelligence, but not as like humans. So, as uh, as we human beings, we should first inquire that uh, what uh, what we want in life. So, we are able to inquire, but animals cannot. So, four things which are common between human beings and animals. First, eating, family, sleeping, uh, fear. Short, eating, sleeping, depending and meeting. These are the four, four things common with animals and human beings. But one thing uh, differentiate us from animals is dharma. Speciality in human, we have dharma so we can inquire. First thing you need to inquire is what is the goal of life. Everybody wants to live life but you need to know how to live a life. Stop existing and start living. But what about leading life? As yesterday Prabhuji told us, second thing, why I am suffering in life? Happiness is the goal of life for human being. Hope. Uh, human being always has hope. When human get married, he lost hope. As like Prabhuji explained yesterday, when he was in school, he had hope. Uh, the driving force of all actions is happiness. Like whatever we do in life, we at then try to feel like we should get happiness from other things. Like uh, we work hard, we make money. But at the end of the day, still people are not satisfied. So we need to ask the question that what is uh, uh, what we want and what is the cause of our suffering. So the second part was like how can I become happy? And second thing is, second question is, what is the cause of our suffering? Until you don't know the cause of suffering, you cannot be happy. Uh, two primary things you should know is goal of life and cause of suffering. Then eyes, uh, like uh, our senses, our senses are not perfect. So, the defects. have tendency of committing mistakes. Our senses have defects, tendency to cheat people, the sense are born to illusion. The only perfect knowledge where you get is Veda because it is not written by humans. Vedic literatures are written by God, it is said by God and written for humans. Vedic literatures are manuals for life, human beings. If you, if you want to lead a good life, yesterday said six percent.
percentage of easy literatures are only available. Ninety-four percent are not available. Most important Vedic literatures are Upanishads. One is how to live in this world. Second is how to get out of this world. Like Prabhuji explained yesterday, the purpose of getting into this world is not uh, is to get out from this world. The point is of Guru, devotee of Krishna, we should be devotee of Krishna, we should practice what is taught. We should be happy with spiritual knowledge. The quality that cannot be separated by objects. We all think we are discussed yesterday.